recorded for training and verification purposes. Following this call, we may contact you to understand your experience. This is without doubt the hardest part of my day. You know Will we go get a salad? Yeah. It's that time again. I don't need salad. He doesn't need salad, just oats. <sighs> Salads. Four bowls of oats a day, this one has. 400 grams. Four bowls of oats a day, the man has. That's a fucking joke. So this room needs to be done up. Like I have those things sorted. They're just in the kitchen. But um, we need to make this like a, you know, you could do like a podcast or something. Yeah. Do you, know, do you ever see Gary V's uh, wall in New York? Yeah. You know, he does all his videos. He's got like a- Really cool background. Trophies and books and shit in the background. Like we could do something like that here, like, do you know what I mean? See why I was on the weights coming off because of uh, how wet the socks are. See, that's how you check, like, because he's sweats it underneath the uh, underneath his clothes. Like, it's only a quick. He only needs a kilo to lose, like, so it's just literally put on a sweatsuit. So it's a skip and takes about 20 minutes, and he, he's only weighing in for 10 seconds, like, so he just needs to be 53 kilos for literally 10 seconds, and then he's grand. He can eat all he wants, fight tomorrow night. At about eight, I'd say. So here we have Glam in his natural habitat. Glued to the shower. Doing all things nutrition. All things nutrition. <coughs> Being the safest, Mr. Lam. Um, Something nutrition like. Mitochondrial biogenesis. Yeah, what's that? Uh, it's increasing the oxidative capacity of your cells by training fasted. Here we go, no lads and ladies. <laughs> you heard it there from the main man. There we go. That's why we've carried on side, skipping with not a drop in them. Is he on weight? It says, yeah, he's grand. Happy days. So today it is Friday and it's weighing day for Carol. So as you'll see, he's just doing a bit of weight cut. He's a kilo to go. It's nothing major. It's only a small bit, but um, in terms of business and stuff, it's um, it's been a big week. There's been a good few developments. Like we said last week, it's going to be probably one of the biggest weeks for the company. Like so, there's stuff going on and there's ideas and thoughts and stuff being worked on like that are crazy. And if we told you, people probably wouldn't believe us. Like, but I suppose that's the beauty of it all. You know, that's why we have this YouTube channel out to show people the behind the scenes stuff. Um, I think we're all quite tired this week. Leon's sick. He's run down. Uh, me and Aaron are the same. I don't know a lot of the other lads. Everyone's run down. Like we've had a very, very, very busy January and it does catch up on your body like I know getting up six o'clock in the morning and finishing at half ten or half nine ten o'clock every night it's not easy like and uh, it does play its toll on you like especially because you could get caught to eat and then you're trying to train on top of it and constantly progress and you know you're trying to be productive at the same time as well as working as a full-time PT you've all this other stuff going on so it does uh, it does catch up with you Fucking jeez, I was waiting on it for ages. See, this bag of bandages now. It's zinc oxide tape. And this is all the stuff that you wrap your hands with, you know, for boxers. Have you got your choices, eh? <laughs> 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 You do a bit of that now, but you'll be doing half pound in order. Yeah. Fucking you're gonna whip the shit out of me. Come on, let me just bang. Come on. 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 He's waiting. He's in the back there now. Fresh as the daisy. Aren't you, Carl? Yeah. And we're just going for Nando's there now. And Luke is it. No, you, Carl? Yeah. So we should drop Carl home there to change his clothes. This is where Carl should be now, inside in school. But he took a day off because he's cutting weight. Look at him. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>
Is it Conor McGregor right up there? Who has the heavy jacket now? Ah. Ah. Conor McGregor. Conor McGregor. So 30 kilo in this bitch. <laughs> Conor McGregor and Johnny Depp working for us. <laughs> Hello, people of Ireland. He's back. Europe. How are you feeling? Uh, fantastic. I told him all about you getting the old uh, engagement done, anyway. So here he is in the flesh. Congratulations, Leon. That's what you believe. I went to the effort of uh, getting onto a patisserie and got him to put the engage ring into a croissant. And didn't she go in and ate the fucking thing yeah, inside cool. Nanny in Paris? Yeah. Um, eventually came out in there. Yeah. Got it onto the finger, so we're laughing. <laughs> I've been out for a few days with El Shingles. Um, <coughs> it was a nasty old door, but glad to be back now, to be honest. I got it when I was in Paris on a holiday with herself. It was actually a Christmas present, so it was a bit of a door, but I'm back fighting fit now again. It's only had work for two days, it wasn't too bad, it would be worse. I suppose I'm a young, fine specimen. Best handshake and all that. Not the right. story. Is he recording now? Yeah. Feel the strength, man. Sure. Alright. See, now you feel less than you two. So I went in. I went in looking at the car, and the first thing he said to me is like, "Geez, you some handshake in your back." Where'd you go? Like, no, no, no. I'll take it at home. You can just take it. I'll give it yeah. to you in the car. Ah, ah, ah. Watch me shingles on the thirty. Yes. How much? Thirty-five. <laughs> Oh. Don't do anything to him though, because he's fighting for us, so no cracking backs, no injuries, no cans of monster, nothing like that. Nothing stupid, no cards, seriously. Monster, no card? No, no If it hasn't happened in a few weeks, try. don't be at it. <laughs> but what do we do? <laughs> <laughs> Back in the day, like. Yeah, go on, just run oh, at him. Just run at him. Run. Oh, jeez. Run so at him. I need an arm patch. Come on, buddy, just do it. <laughs> no. Come on. Come on, like. Just do it, like. Do it for the no. vine, like. Don't be cursing in the office. Come on. Just do it, come on. Come on, just do it. Do one. Come on. Come on. Just do one. Just do one. Need you have to do it, like. <laughs> because it's good for YouTube, like. Because you can do it, like. This is what YouTube people want to see. Come on, go. Jump. Jump, jump. Oh, Jesus. Come on, go. Watch his sham. Watch his sham. That's yeah. your, that's your shoes gone over. He wouldn't see McGregor doing that tonight before his fight, boy. Shots, did he get it? Menacing methods label me a lethal weapon Making niggas die, witnessing breathless imperfections Can you picture my specific plan? To be the man in this wicked land Underhanded hits a plan uh, Scams are plotted over grams of rocks Undercover agents die by the random shot We all die in the end, so the fans be swell I was all about my ends, fuck friends and foes Me, a poor leader, never lead a block without my heater Got me a dog and named him my bitch nigga Eater What could they do to me, a little brat? Shit, them niggas that shot me Still terrified I get they ass How can I show you how I feel inside We outlaws, motherfuckers can't kill my pride Niggas talk a lot of shit But that's after them gone Cause they fear me in the physical form Let them be known I'm troublesome <laughs> So it's Sunday, 4th of February. Uh, we just had Carl's fight last night. First fight under Team Tanyon, full camp with uh, yeah. Josh. And it went extremely well, so he got the win. Um, I made a great sport for all the lads, all of us uh, from work, we are myself, Josh Cooney, all the girlfriends and stuff like that, Ryan O'Brien. Um, 
So it was a good turnout. Yeah, he done exactly what we asked. Like so, in fairness, you know, he uh, got the win. It was hard, gritty fight, but he done the job. It's um, we just got our office work done. The lads were training. I just saw him. That's why he looked like a uh, shit. She. She. Um. So we're just rounding up the day now. Back to work now. Six o'clock in the morning. So tune in and stay tuned.